Hello everyone, Harry Jesse here and today I'm going to be teaching you how to amplify your audio sound if you don't have a mic. Now this is a trick I learned through experimenting and some people might think it's ridiculous, especially content creators, but if it works, it works, so why not? Now we're going to be doing this using the InShot app. Any editing app can basically do this. I use the InShot app to edit my videos, so that's what we're going to be using for this video. So now let's get to it. So to start, we go to the InShot app, we click on video, new, and then we pick a video of our choice. Hello everyone, make sure you don't forget to like and subscribe, okay? Now I made this video without a mic, and now we are going to amplify the sound. We go to volume, you scroll to the right, you scroll to the right and you click on volume. Now you could have used the noise, but there is no unwanted background sound. So there is no point clicking on the noise. So I'm going to just remove that. Now what I'm just going to do is. Hello everyone. 200. So now the quality has been increased. Hello everyone. Make sure you don't forget to like and subscribe. Okay. Now the difference is not that noticeable, but we are not done. So now we're going to save it. Now, when we are done saving it, you go back to the InShot app, click on video, click on new, and pick the video you just edited. Not the original one, but the video that was just edited. And go to volume again and increase it. And now we have amplified the sound quality by 400%. You go to save. So now let's compare the original video to the second edited video. Hello everyone, make sure you don't forget to like and subscribe, okay? Hello everyone, make sure you don't forget to like and subscribe, okay? So now you can see the difference between the original video and the second edited one. The volume was basically amplified 400 times more, although it might not sound like an $100 camera or something like that, but it definitely amplified the volume, which is the bare minimum we aim to achieve as content creators. Now the downside to this is that it is time consuming because you have to download download edit the video twice and download it twice and it also consumes more memory space because downloading it twice would obviously mean twice as much space but at the end of the day the unwanted videos will be deleted so it's fine now i know this trick seems ridiculous but don't hate it until you try it now that's it for this video i have other videos on how to edit on InShot, how to clone yourself and if you're interested just click on this playlist here and I'll see you in my next video. Till then, I remain your one and only Harpy Jessie. Bye.